You either die here or live long enough to become the villain. This is my story. What's good, gamers? It's your boy Dagazi back again with another video. In today's video, it's gonna be a little bit sadder. I'm putting an end to the Madden 24 chapter of my life, man. I think it's time in today's video we're gonna go over all the things that one don't work, two did wrong, or three just I don't know. It's EA. We'll go with that. Number one is going to be BND cards. I absolutely cannot stand BND cards. The fact that you can't put them in the sets. Like, it basically makes no money, no money spent. Just now it matter. But it's not even like the main focus of today's video. The focus I want on today's video is going to be more things that just aren't working. Or just EA just randomly took out. Starting off. We are going to go to, actually I don't want to look at that, we're going to go to head to head. I'm going to show you guys something that actually no one has talked about, which I found weird. I want you guys to look at my coins right now. That's 24,096. 24,096. All right. Pretty standard. All right. So let's go. When I go to rewards and divisions, I don't really care about this. I was mainly testing this out earlier just to make sure it's every game. Now, based on my per game rewards for a loss, I should be getting 350 coins for a win, 1500 coins, sure. Like I said, I want you guys to keep an eye on that coin count right there, and we're going to come right out of this game. Everything is going to be in this video. It's not going to be edited in any way, shape, or form. So you're going to see me go out right away after we get in here, just like so. All I'm going to do is quit right away and see if I get 350 coins. So this guy's going to get a free win. Beautiful team right there. Shannon Sharp leading it off. I like to see it. My squad right here. Not as good, but still swal solid squad right there. Nothing crazy. Alrighty, come on. Come on, yeah. Also, another thing I would like to complain about is how it takes a minute. I did count that earlier. It takes about a minute, 10 seconds to get into a game and log out of a game. That's a minute that nobody has. And we got 20 minutes of game time. Well, 16 minutes of game time. Sorry. So we're going to just fair catch this and we're going to quit on my boy real quick. GG's my friend. Hey, he said GG, see? The Madden community is great. The people I can respect. Now here we go, out of the game. Now did I get my coins? Yeah, this is a valued question. Look at that. My coin count did not move. Yeah, it did not move. So for every loss that people have taken... You're not getting coins for that. So let's do some quick math right here. Now I'm no math genius, but let's just assume this guy's on the same rank as me. Obviously he's not, but he has wow, 395 losses. Okay, times that by 350 coins. So he's missed out on 138,000 coins just because EA doesn't pay out losses. I mean, dude has 67 Super Bowls. I'm sure he's fine. That's 130 grand he's just missing out on because EA can't do their job and won't do their job. Like, I don't really understand it, but it's something I noticed today. I'm not really a head-to-head -head guy, so it's more of just something. Once I realized they took my playbooks out, I had to go see what head-to-head -head was like. And yeah, I realized wasn't getting my rewards. Another thing I hate is absolutely this competitive pass. These garbage from the bones down. Terrible. I don't really mind, like... Dailies, I'm fine with. I love dailies. I'll do dailies every day of the week, mainly because it doesn't force me into a game mode. I can do any game mode and get these. That's that's chill. That's whatever. The one thing I dislike though is for the competitive pass, how it's just all this. You got to play solo bass. You got to play head to head. You got to play mud champs. This is forcing people into games they don't really want to play. As y'all can see, I've jumped around just a little bit, just messing around with them but really i just have no desire to play those games and i'm forced to at least play one of them to get my xp here i think it'd be cool if like there's a mutt champs competitive pass a solo battle competitive pass a head-to-head -head pass and just whoever the first 100 players are to each one or 300 at each pass gets the reward so then you get to play what you want but you still get the same reward so if someone wants to play all three they can play all three but they don't have to it's just so easy for you to fix these little things and now like for this you have to go into one of these modes i'm a menu guy i like playing solos and i like playing the menu i don't really like going into stuff like that so at the end of the day it's just not my thing but this is what it is at the end of the day competitive pass i feel like i feel like it's ruining the game 
head to head just not tracking wins i've also heard is a major problem I've seen a lot of people commenting under ea's tweets about that it seems like they are hiding those tweets as they get them so the second someone says hey my head to head wins aren't tracking ea quickly removes that response or just hides it so it's harder to see just standard ea behavior but that's beside the point and in my final thing the reason i truly hate 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 madden and have honestly just gave up playing it i'm going to gta 5 and honestly i might not even get the next madden i might just wait till gta 6 and then grind out videos for that so maybe the next time you guys see me realistically i'll probably will get the next madden i'm a mutt i'm not a, really a mutt guy i'm a madden guy i love football i'm a football man i love football to the bones as y'all can tell an eagles fan right there couldn't even do an eagles theme team this year it's just too expensive but good squad all together when you've lost everything, you have nothing left to lose but hope. The problem is, my hope for Madden went down the drain the second I saw. I could no longer sell playbooks of any kind. It was sad. They changed the max and the minimum, flopped them right away. Can't sell anything. As y'all can see, when you go to try to sell something, boom, 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 yep. Can't be above the max. Let's see if you go below the max. Then it says you're going. Certain bid entered is lower than the minimum allowed of 36 grand. So now I've not only 27 playbooks in my binder that are completely useless. Now say I bought these each at 50 grand. Now I can't sell them. I'm stuck with the uniform. I've spent 50 grand. Now obviously that's not what I was doing. There's a reason I'm at 24,000 coins. Luckily for me, I sold off quickly <laughs> before EA. Caught on to this. Now we do have a few cute little presents in here. Nothing crazy. Quick sold my lavishes on this account. I've won 3,500 lavish on a backup account, but other than that, kind of been casual. Another thing I did want to mention is this eight, the Will of, blah, 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 Will Levis. He's supposed to get a 94 today. EA didn't mention it. Four hours later, changes overall in here to be to show up as a 93. It was a 94 for the greatest time, but now I have 24 packs. Of unis that I cannot sell. They're just, they're just there. And I have 50 on a backup account because, like I said, I was selling these for profit, make them for 1,500 coins. You sell them for eight grand. Obviously, I'm gonna do it. Now I'm stuck. The bunch of unis. Excuse me, that I can't sell. Now I got 23. I gotta pick out and just do. Like, it'd be cool if EA made it so like a quick sell, like two grand. I mean, be better than nothing, but at the end of the day, I'm stuck with over a hundred of these with this account and backup accounts, which is just because I was making profit selling them at seven grand. It's not because I was like cheating the system or anything. I was doing a no money spent coin method. Whenever I'd pop on, post 20 of those up, call it a day. Now, if you guys want to look at my recent sales, just so I can kind of show y'all that i'm not like lying about anything like this is the profit i'm talking about and you could buy three golds at like 1500 coins just sell them off the good days of what gone it was a great method too because like no youtuber big youtuber is willing to talk about because it, it just wasn't big enough but yeah it's just Luckily for me, like I said, I did sell off my coins prior to EA doing this, so that was nice. But there are still people selling and buying coins. And yeah, I've already talked to some quality people about some methods running around. And yeah, they're good. I'm not going to I'm not gonna say that I don't want to help EA in any term, but yeah. Like you used to be able to just, let's go corset here. You buy three golds, throw them into a set right there, look at that. 750 1350 coins and then sell it for eight grand man right there that's what eight grand take tax that's seven grand subtract 1500 because that's about where i was getting them at that's 5500 flip a few of those you know max cards in your binder eventually and then yeah just kind of how it went but yeah took it away people are still buying golds so i'm not sure i'm sure there's something i don't know yeah, that destroyed the, the only thing 
that was keeping my no money spent account kind of alive. It was the only way I was making coins at like a decent rate. And now cards like this are going to go for 200 coins. Would have went for zero if I didn't put that bid on there. But yeah, it's just one of those things, man. You're just killing their own game. There's nothing I can do about that, but at the end of this video, I do think I'm going to throw up some highlights. I'm going to go play a regs game. And then I'll show you as the start of it so you guys can see who I'm playing. If they don't quit out at the end of this video, I'll just throw up a few highlights. Just to show that I'm not bad at the game. The game is more killing itself. Because a lot of people believe anyone that criticizes Madden just isn't good at the game. Which just isn't true. So yeah, we're going to go into a game. I'm going to play as the Chiefs mainly because I like their playbook that's the only reason but if you guys want to look at my um, not sure what this shows okay I'm 4 and 0 in regs I don't play regs a whole lot obviously as y'all can tell but yeah 4 and 0 let's go see if we can make it 5 and 0 maybe I'll just end this video with showing that I'm 5 and 0 if I make it but other than that it's been what I can see and I'm out of here Peace. sorry to leave y'all in a sad video y'all know I'm not like this majority of the time much love, though, for anyone that's watching. I appreciate y'all. That's that kid's signing out. Probably for the last time I'm Madden 24. Unless there's a glitch, because I'm always going to send those to y'all. Now, my friends. It was a 75 yard rushing touchdown. Hey. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, oh. Ah, I thought I had him. Came in, I thought I had him up top. Anyway, we'll kick another on Sider. I think I can get this one and make him quit. I'd be impressed if he didn't quit after this one. There it is. My ball. Nothing. Wow. People really take a beating in this game nowadays. It used to be like you were up 14, man. They were done. This guy is not done. He wants to get beat more. I mean, it's a respectable quality, I guess, to want to get your ass kicked. What are you doing? Oh, man. There it is. I mean, truly, the man has got to quit eventually. But, yeah, there it is. 34 to 8. We won. I mean, pretty standard right there. Yeah. Yeah, not happening. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Okay. GG's, buddy. 34 to 8. As I was saying, man. I'm good at that. I'm not bad. I'm not bad at that. The game just sucks. Now, if you guys want to see again, just to you know, show it off. That dude is zero and one. Okay, I respect it. This is his first game. Probably shouldn't play again. And I'm obviously five and zero. Oh. But yeah, I just want to show y'all that I can win a game because most people just believe anyone that hates on the game just kind of sucks at the game, which is a fair argument. But yeah, in this case. You know, it's not true. I'm just not a fan of the game this year. Or most years. This year in particular, I feel like it's going downhill. But I don't want to leave you on a negative note. So all I want to say is don't have a good day. Have a great day. And that's been your boy, I can see. I'm logging off. Peace.